Hi, I'm Jonas. Do you know what open source is? Well, let me explain it for you. Basically, it means that the recipe of any given work is shared and free for anybody to use. Let me take you back where it all started. In the 1980s, a guy named Richard Stallman had a problem with the software in his printer. He could fix the printer himself, but unfortunately, he was not allowed to get inside the black box by the manufacturer. This frustration was the beginning of the free and open source movement. The essential benefits of open source are access to the source or recipe of any given work, free remix and redistribution of any given work, an end to predatory vendor lock-in, and a higher degree of cooperation. Open source is originally a software-related term, but let's take a non-technical example of where the open source mindset is actually used today. Here's Dave. He is a really passionate skateboarder. He loves the community because everyone shares tips and tricks openly. This means that everybody has access to the source of becoming a better skateboarder. Dave has the opportunity of remixing an existing trick and making it even better. He becomes more skilled, faster. If Dave's skateboard breaks, he doesn't necessarily have to go back to the vendor to get it fixed. He can also fix it himself with the help of one of his friends from the community. This is because the design of the skateboard is open source. In the skateboard community, you share new ideas and remix each other's tricks. You cooperate and reach much higher standards than any skateboarder could reach alone. Now let's take another example. Here's Susan and Michael. They have just bought a new property and now need a new house. John is an open source architect and offers three designs that Susan and Michael can base their dream house on. They choose option A because it best fits their needs. But Susan wants a conservatory as well, so Michael draws one and adds that as an extension to their chosen house design, option A. Susan and Michael choose company A to help build the house. It should be easy for company A to build it because the architectural drawings and guidelines are already produced by John, the open source architect. But during the process, Susan and Michael find out that company A's employees are very slow and not very polite. They therefore get company B to finish the work. It's easy for company B to take over the project because everything is openly documented. Fortunately, company B does an amazing job of completing the construction project. In the meantime, Coco and June have shared a new solar cell design as an extension to option A as well. Susan and Michael also decide to add that to their home. Susan and Michael are now happy owners of a beautiful and customized new home. But John is also happy. He can now add two new extensions to his professional portfolio without having done anything himself. So now I've given you a taste of some of the many benefits of open source. But before I leave you, I have to put an end to some of the myths that still exist. First, you have no control of your work. That's not true. As the initiator, John, the open source architect, verifies extensions and chooses what can be added to his specific project and therefore also decides where the project is heading. Second, open equals unsafe. Not true. In an open source project, many people are involved and cooperate to make an even safer product and to keep unauthorized people out. And third, everything is free. No, the source itself is free and publicly available, but the house must, for example, still be built, customized, maintained, and provided with water, power, and heat. Hopefully you can now better understand the positive term open source and the principles within. Please start opening up and use the extreme beneficial principles the way they deserve. As mentioned, my name is Jonas, and I'm representing Bit Blueprint. We have, in collaboration with Moving Monday, made this video to help scale the positive principles within the open source paradigm. We have, of course, made this video free for everyone to use, modify, and share. So feel free to do that. Thanks for watching.